What is up guys, today we're going to be doing an ideas video. It's basically what Rockstar should put in GTA 5 online. Um, with this new update coming out soon, like September 20th, at least I think that, September 20th, 2016, at least I believe that that's when it's coming out. Okay, so anyways, I figured, hey, why not put, why not um, post a video of what I think should be put in GTA 5 online, and let's see if if any of this stuff gets put in there yeah and um, I have one thing to say too I finally figured out how to put the emblem on the car it's quite easy fix I'm not gonna really get into it but I'm gonna be doing some crates in the background um, I might you know like stutter a little bit because I mean I'm trying to also do crates too since this is not pre-recorded, pre just doing it all at once. But anyways, without further ado, let's get into this. Okay, so number one, a 20-car garage, yes. I would love to see Rockstar put in like a 20 or even a 15, something like that. Um, and in addition to that idea, I would think th I think they should put in something like where you can create your own garage, like... I wouldn't say like number of slots because of course everyone's gonna choose the high one, highest one. But like changing the color of it, like you know, like the high end ones, like the lights come up and it's just white. What if you could put like blue or green or purple, something like that? I figured, hey, that would be a cool idea to put in for like a, I don't know, another DLC. Um, T bucket. That's a car. Um, I don't know if you guys really know what it is. If not, look it up on like Google Images or something. My grandpa owns one. It's pretty cool. I wish GTA had it so that I put it in this list. Um, bigger warehouses. I want big warehouses. Okay, like so you can put more crates in it. Like four, like buy like four crates and like twenty-five thousand. But yet again, you also have like a bigger, large house warehouse, like bigger than large. I don't know, like they can call it like extra large or some crap. Um but yeah, you make more money, like I don't know. I don't know, maybe four million, something like that. I don't know. GTA will figure it out. Um along with that, um I would like so that you could purchase like bot associates, basically, like you can purchase associates. Um Cabs online, like I know they have them, but on story mode, you can like take a cab and like drive around picking people up and bring them to locations. And if you do that online, you should be able to make money, you know what I mean? Get a little extra cash. More house, more houses, okay? And where you can customize your own apartment. That would be cool to see in GTA 5 online. Where I think they could put that building like they could probably I would be fine with just making one I'm cool with that and along with that you can also customize your own garage those two can kind of like you know go together um at the end of this video I will show you what building I am talking about that they can um put this idea in unless if they're saving it for something else uh, more heist I want to see more heist it's just these five heists that we have they're just getting old real big old and like with this more like if they do do new heists like maybe let's do like a three person job or more two persons I don't know um I mean a lot of time I don't we don't have like four friends on at one time so it's hard to do heist anymore um I would like to see more variety of delivery vehicles for these crates uh, like if I continue to do them like you know when you sell them there's like the tie-in for air travel there's like that other plane and then with the tugboat that's only boat delivery and then the land deliveries the truck well I mean there's two air delivery vehicles there should be two water and two land or even do three air three land three water I don't know more I mean it's just getting old what can I say or you know they can just take out the delivery part and you just sell it and get the money but they they won't do that um, they should 
Okay, so the next one, a police DLC. Basically, like, cops and crooks or something like that that they had on GTA 4. I, I never played it, but... Um, people say it's really good, so they could do that in the police DLC. You can purchase police cars, so you should be able to do that. Um, get ambulance um, and fire trucks. Basically do like a law enforcement or whatever you want to call it, DLC. I don't know, I think that would be cool. Um, this one, I mean, you can add this in ben Benny's probably they could do it. Um, spinners, if you don't know what the spinners are, it's basically, it's rims, okay? And like, let's say you stop at like a stoplight, you, if you look at the rims, they will like keep on spinning, even though you're not moving. I mean, I, I think it would be pretty cool to have on GTA. Um, you should be able to buy like 10 properties. I mean, in real life... You can own as many properties as you want. I mean, I don't know why they limit you in GTA 5 online. You should be able to buy 10 at least. I don't know, but you should... Okay, this one I definitely agree, and I bet you a lot of people do too. You should be able to purchase Pegasus vehicles. I mean, um, sell Pegasus vehicles. Yeah, you can purchase them. But anyways, you should be able to sell them. Because, I mean, like if you bought like the... What is it called? The Hydra for $4 million, I think if you don't like it anymore, like, some people would like to get money back, like, even if you get, like, two million, I mean, if I purchased a Hydra, which I didn't, I would like to at least get two million back, I mean, especially this upcoming DLC, if, hey, I'm not using the Hydra, let's get two million dollars, but yeah, it would be nice to do that, because I have a couple Pegasus vehicles that I don't use anymore, um, they should add in more Benny's cars, which, uh, I've seen a video, and it's like, the new DLC, whatever, I don't know. It showed a Pegasus vehicle as the, uh, I'm mean, not Pegasus. Uh, Benny's vehicle, like a, it's like a new truck or something like that, and Benny's as their thumbnail. Um, I don't know. That might be a new thing in the DLC. I have no idea. But they should definitely put in more Benny's cars. Cause come on, Rockstar, you want people to buy your shark cards, but yet again, you're not putting in Benny cars, which people spend a lot of money on. But yeah, they should add that. Um, custom license plate. Oh my god, I kind of want this. I mean, they kind of did it in Benny's where you can like customize it a little bit, like get like different wording. But like, I mean, like actually be able to type it in. They have it in Midnight Club. That's a Rockstar game. Um, yeah, you should be able to actually like type in like, I don't know, whatever you want. Or even if they don't do that, even your clan tag. Like mine is. Uh, hang on, let's get this cargo delivered out of here. Mine is UTUB, standing for YouTube. If I could put that on a license plate, I'd be fine with that. You should be able to customize your own license plate. Um, tow trucks. Purchasing tow trucks. That sh Actually, that could be added into the police DLC. But anyways, you should be able to have a tow truck on GTA Online. I understand that you can go up and take someone's car. But what does the cargo bob do? That's even worse. You can take all, a lot of other stuff with a cargo bob than with just a tow truck. But yeah, you should, you should be able to purchase tow trucks. I kind of want to do that. I I don't really do story mode anymore. I've already completed a lot. I don't do it anymore. That's the only place I can get a tow truck, and I think tow trucks are awesome. Um, Skateboards. I mean, they have this pedals something cr website where you can buy bikes but they haven't done anything with that since the release of GTA um I mean it's always been the way it is there's no DLC for it they should make um skateboards put that in there probably I don't know I think it would go in there but anyways you should be able to skateboard do be some cool tricks we can make a montage whatever but yeah that would be dope um the casino over by the horse track um, that would be nice to see it open, but the problem is that um, I th believe is the actual issue with that is the okay. Let's say you go out and use all your money on shark cards to um, gamble it all away, and you lose it all. It's gambling, and most of us—I'm not even 18. Not even old enough to gamble yet. 
and I guess in other countries there's laws against it or whatever in state other states I mean I live in New York but I mean I, I don't th I think it'd still be an issue honestly but yeah but if they do open up the casino it'll probably just be for you know just making I don't know just like doing some extra fun games I guess I mean I don't I don't think that'll be as fun though because I mean GTA what do people come online to do make money and spend all of it I don't know but I mean that's probably all that's gonna happen with the casino either just it's gonna stay like that or it's just gonna be free basically you walk in there play a couple games walk out and you don't spend any money and you don't get any money might be able to get RP but come on I already have enough I mean I don't think there's anything else I can Honestly, I don't know if I can... At this level, I don't think I can get anything else. I think I already have everything. I'm not sure. Um, But what I think might be this DLC coming up soon is... um, the Biker DLC. I mean, a lot of people said it. And I mean, I believe it. I think it will be that. And if it is, I would like them to put in um, a bike... A purchasable bike like you know like you ride it on this like right hand side there's like the little cart thing it might be the left I don't know but someone could sit in the cart on the side um I don't really know what they're called I just know it's a motorcycle with a side thing for someone to sit in wouldn't that be pretty cool for GTA 5 online that would be so dope um but yeah that will be it for all these amazing ideas that I've had. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. And now for this end of this video. This is the building I'm talking about, guys. This building right here. You should be able to um, customize. Like They finish this building to make it look like every other building in GTA. And then you should be able to like customize it. I don't know, maybe this could be the front, maybe? Okay, and then, um, maybe come around here. Is there, there's, yeah, there's there's an entry. Pay this off and have this as the garage entry, maybe? Take out all the cranes, um, that look, yeah, that, that, that looks like a place to go walking across. This could be just some other thing. Maybe even a biker bar. Yeah. For this new biker DLC. I don't know. But yeah. They should finish this off and do that. I mean. I don't know. It looks like they're using it to plan something. I don't know. But that will be it for this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.